Hi everyone, welcome to the coding channel. Today is the first episode of our Java tutorial series for beginners. And in this episode, we are going to download and install the latest version of Java and Eclipse IDE as well. Listen more when we come back. Just like any other programming languages, before you can create and uh, run your first ever Java program, you need a an installer. And um, luckily, that uh, Java is an open source programming uh, language, which only means that we can download and install it for free via Java Development Kit. And for us to download it, just go to oracle.com slash java uh, page, and then just click the download the Java button. And then as of July 2021, the latest version of Java for uh, you know, beginners is the Java SE 16. And just click the JDK download here. And then uh, down below, uh, you just have to select the um, um, installer for um, Windows uh, 10, for example, a 64 bit, so this one. And then I just uh, click this, I reviewed and accept the Oracle technology. And it will start um, downloading um, for you okay um, and then um, after that you just have to double click this file and it will start um, the installation process once you have um, installed the uh, java development kit in your operating system you can just um, double click it the, the um, uh, command prompt and then to check the latest version here, so you just have to type Java space dash and then version. So once you see this uh, response, it only means that you have successfully installed the uh, Java. And you can now actually start your first ever Java program. Like for instance, I have a pre prepared here um, a basic um, a Java program. Okay, so you just have to save this one with that Java uh, extension. For example, you want to save this uh, inside of, of our um, in drive D for example you just have to specify uh, that uh, Java okay save okay let's just try to replace that one and then so after saving using notepad um, editor you can actually compile that one uh, but we need to replace first the um, the prompt here using a D prompt because we save our Java file in uh, drive D and then we are now ready to uh, compile by using uh, the command java c java c is the java compiler then followed by the uh, file name which is sample one dot java so this is the simple um, command to um, compile your first ever java program and uh, after pressing the enter key if you uh, haven't seen any um, error here that only means uh, our uh, program um, compile successfully and we are now ready to run or execute our java program to execute you just have to type uh, java and then uh, space and then sample um, one okay java here is the um, java compiler which is the we use to uh, run a java uh, program and then press the enter key and then as you can see um, this um, program only uh, display the um, console output and you know hello uh, world and then the prompt um, appears again but in this um, episode not only in this episode but in the entire um, tutorial series we will not uh, be using the um, notepad and um, command prompt but instead we will use the um, latest version of an eclipse ide so ide uh, which means that uh, integrate it's it only means an uh, integrated development environment um, it's a um, user of friendly compared to a uh, notepad just like the the, the color coded uh, code um, and then um, and a lot more okay so I suggest that uh, we can uh, start from uh, developing on um, for a simple Java program using Eclipse IDE. But aside from Eclipse, you also have um, one of the top three most commonly used on IDE nowadays. We have the NetBeans IDE, the IntelliJ, and then the Eclipse. But I just prefer um, Eclipse so that we can just um, start it uh, from scratch, you know, the hard-coded um, uh, way. Now, if you launch the Eclipse IDE for the first time, 
you will often uh, see this um, environment. Uh, there are uh, five tabs, um, basic tabs actually, the, the Packers Explorer, and then the Editor, um, the Outline, and then where we see the um, output over here. Um, not normally, um, what I um, do is I, I change the um, uh, appearance because I I want to to have a um, a dark theme. So just go to uh, Windows and then Preferences and then select the appearance and then uh, dark and then um, uh, apply. Okay, so just like this. Okay, and then um, if you want to, uh, for example, this one is um. I don't uh, usually use this, so you can just close or uh, just uh, minimize this one. So let's say uh, close, and then um, this window I want to uh, position it here. Uh, for example, over here, so I can just uh, also um, minimize this one. So here, yep. and then um, um, to start with, let's uh, try to create our first um, uh, project in uh, Java. So just go to uh, create a project and then you just have to uh, type the project name. For example, um, our project is uh, tutorial or should I say Java tutorial? And then just uh, um, click uh, finish. Uh, make sure that you have uh, selected this, um, but actually this is a default. Okay, whatever you um, install, um, uh, version of Java so you can um, see here now the latest version that we have um, um, installed and then you just have to click uh, finish now after creating a uh, project it's about time to um, create a class inside of our project just select the uh, class there and then um, the source folder is the our Java tutorial and then you can uh, type on um, the package name for example episode uh, let's say episode one and then the name of our class um, uh, for example um, uh, sample one and then uh, check the um, check box here which methods uh, stops would you like to create and then click the uh, finish um, button and after that you can um, see now this type of um, environment. So we have the package explorer and then the uh, sample uh, one at Java. Now, if you like to uh, close this one, okay, we can actually close this one so that um, the only available here is the um, uh, editor tab. Okay, so you can just uh, minimize, for example, this one or, uh, or close. Or if, for example, if you have a uh, close the those on um, tabs, you can um, actually uh, make it visible again. Go to win uh, window and then show view. And then all the other tabs are here. For example, the um, explorer, the package explorer. Okay, if you want to display the console or the uh, the outline and the and other tabs. Okay, that you would like to make it uh, visible. Okay, so this is now the simple um, uh, the simple code that we need to familiarize if you're going to start on your programming in Java. Okay, and there should be um, a, a class and then the main method. But uh, don't worry, um, our main goal in this episode is just um, to display an output and to get uh, the user input. Okay, so... Um, we will uh, discuss some of the um, uh, advanced topics in our um, next episode. And that's all for today. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing. And as always, show your love through comments and favorites. God bless and thank you for watching.